looks so strange in blue. What do we think? Does blue suit me or do I look like an eight year old? <laughs> Hello everybody, welcome back to my YouTube channel. Welcome to my first Christmas video of 2019. I can't believe it's nearly Christmas. I mean, it's November, but technically it's nearly Christmas. A lot of people are gonna be hating because it's November, it's not Christmas time, but our Christmas tree is up, which means one thing, it's Christmas. So for my first Christmassy, oh, when I say the word Christmas, I'm just like, so for my first Christmas video, I thought I'd do a kind of gift guide slash a stocking filler guide. I've never done a Christmas video before, so there's a first time for everything. So in this video, I'm just gonna be giving you a few kind of stocking filler ideas, Christmas gifts for him, Christmas gifts for her, and all of that good stuff. <laughs> I haven't stuck to one style, I haven't done just for him, I haven't done just for her. I've got adults, kids, just a basically a big mix of everything in this video. So if you do enjoy it, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up, subscribe down below for more from me, and let's just jump in. So I'm gonna start with, I'm gonna say boys, but obviously this can be for him or her. It's just, I'm gonna put it under the men's slash boys category. So we all know boys are extra, extra hard to buy for. They're so picky, so indecisive, and just hard to please. Every man loves a beer. So here we have a Stormtrooper beer set. So this is just a beer and a glass, and it's got a Stormtrooper on there from Star Wars, and what better thing could a man want in their life than Star Wars beer? I picked this up from B&M, I'm sure it was about four pounds, and they had a lot of different ones. They didn't just have Star Wars. So if you are going to a B&M, this is a good shout for a present for a man. They have all different films. And yeah, just, even if you're a girl and you love Star Wars and beer, I'm not trying to like discriminate, but <laughs> this is for you. So yeah, 3 dollars easily pleased. I feel like alcohol is not a cop out, but it's just an easy present to get somebody. So I'll pick this one up. 3 dollars B&M. And if they're not happy with that, then can't help. <laughs> but on Christmas day, everyone loves to have a drink, everyone loves to have fun, everyone loves to play family games. So, the next thing I picked up is this head basketball. <laughs> um, the funny thing is I'm actually gonna be giving these presents out to friends and family, so if you're watching, this may be for you. You never know. I can't really tilt it because you can get the light on there. But basically you have a basketball net and a headband. You put the headband around your head and you've got little balls to throw in. <laughs> so if that doesn't scream family Christmas game, I don't know what does. So inside you get 20 balls, a head basketball loop, and it fits tiny and massive heads apparently. So it'll fit my massive head, it'll fit your massive head, it'll fit his tiny head, <laughs> it'll just fit everyone's heads. Again, b and I feel like B&M is the place to be for Christmas. Christmas everything, Christmas presents, Christmas decorations, Christmas food. Just anything Christmas related, B&M is the place to go. I'm sure this was an offer, it says 3 dollars up here. But I'm pretty sure I paid £2 for this. It says it contains loads of fun, so we will see. But stuff like this, it'll keep the family entertained for ages on Christmas Day. It'll be such a laugh. And yeah, that is the second one that I've picked up. So sticking on to the theme of kind of board games, family time on Christmas Day, I picked up Speak Out. My ring light's gonna be doing my head in this video, sorry. So if you don't know what this game is, you pretty much have these things that go in your mouth. So your mouth is spread out so you can't talk properly and you have to read out these sentences, I'm pretty sure. You have to read something out and you have to basically guess what they're saying but because you've got that thing in your mouth, it's basically impossible but it's gonna be so funny. Family time, Christmas day, just something to bring everyone happiness and just laugh because it's gonna be so funny. It says age is 16 plus, but anyone can play it really. As long as the mouth thing fits in your mouth, you can play. It says you can have four to 10 players. So big game, big family game, loads of fun on Christmas day. Who wouldn't want to play a Christmas board game? It's not board game, Christmas game on Christmas day. Pick this up. This was from, I'm pretty sure I got this one from the entertainer in town. So I'm gonna switch it up a little bit now. I'm gonna move on to the girls. So one present idea we have is I feel like every girl knows what this bag is. If you don't know what this bag is, it's Victoria's Secret. <laughs> so in this bag, we have some Victoria's Secret body sprays. So we have three here. So we have Victoria's Secret Diamond Petals, like a pink glittery bottle. We have Victoria's Secret Rush. This is my favorite one, personal favorite, Rush. I just don't think you can beat it. I'm not gonna spray them because they are 
present for someone. Then we have Victoria's Secret Love Addict. Again, love these. Every girl loves Victoria's Secret. Every girl loves to get in body sprays. So these are the perfect combination. And Victoria's Secret always, always, always have an offer on in there. So last year I'm sure I got five for 25, which is really good. But this year I got three for 27, I want to say. They're pretty much going to be a guaranteed approval from the person you're giving it to. But they're not going to not like these, unless they don't like the smell. Which would be sad. But personally I like these smells, so I got these three. But yeah. Victoria's Secret Body Spray is always a winner. The next thing we have is kind of for more like the people who love just chilling and having a little pamper session. These are going to be for them. So we have, these are all from Superdrug by the way, all really cheap, all really affordable. And I'm pretty sure Superdrug was three for two when I got all these as well, so bargain. So we have three different face masks here. I'm not going to try and pronounce them. But yeah, we've got three different peel off face masks. We've got one, two, three, just for someone that loves to have a chilled night in, put a face mask on, do whatever they're doing, peel it off, and you have fresh skin. You can't beat a face mask. Boys and girls love face masks. As much as boys like to deny it, they love a good face mask. And then we also have the foot packs. So if someone's got crusty, dusty feet, Winner win a chicken dinner. I probably shouldn't associate a chicken dinner and crusty feet in the same sentence. I've never used a foot pack, but I've heard good things. So I've got three different ones here again, three for two. We've got tea tree and peppermint, marulia, marula oil. I don't know you say that one, embarrassing. And we have honey and almond. Again, three for two. They just slip on like socks, I'm pretty sure, yeah. Then it's to hydrate your feet. Again, for someone that likes to sit down, have their feet up, chill for a good half an hour. How long do you leave these on for? 15, 20 minutes. Perfect. Boys or girls, anyone would love a good foot pack. Some people might find it a bit insulting if you got them a foot pack. But if you haven't seen their feet, then you've got an excuse to get them a foot pack. Because you can't, I haven't seen your feet. I don't know if you've got crusty toes. So the next thing we have is more suited to kind of the younger children, I want to say because I picked this up for my little sister but she's already got one so I'm going to have to take this back and get something else but I thought I'd show it in this video anyway so I've picked up a hidden surprise bath bomb mix and mould kit my little sister is obsessed with baths and bath bombs so I thought I'd pick this up but someone's already beaten me to it so this is going back I've got no one else in my family that would like have any use for a bath bomb maker so this is going back and I'm going to pick her up something else but I thought this was really good so you get like a full on station to make your bath bombs you got glitter glue what else do you get in here colored powders then all instructions on how to do it so this is the list of stuff you get in there i'm not going to go through it all but you get quite a lot in there and it's a big box it says it's for ages eight plus but my little sister's six but i feel like she would absolutely love this i never really go by the ages that are on there i just think if they're if they like it get it yeah, this could keep children entertained obviously they might need some help with it but if someone's got the time to sit and do this with them, this could be a really fun family little project, making bath bombs and they can get in the bath with the bath bomb. I think it's such a cute idea. I'm just sad that someone's really beat me to it. And again, I picked this up from the entertainer and this was only £10, so it's half price. was 20 now £10, which I think is such a good price for all of this set that you get in there. I don't know, I might give it to her anyway. She might have two. I might just get her to keep both since she does love a good bath bomb but yeah 10 pounds from the entertainer keep children's entertained adults entertained win-win so the next thing i have is a tangle teaser it's not an officially not the official brand tangle teaser but it's the same thing so it's just this pink tangle teaser i got this from a shop called tiger in town i've never been in there before but i picked up so much stuff when i went into target the other day i got so many stocking fillers it's just full of little bits and pieces that you can just stick in someone's stocking Stuff that no one actually needs, but everyone kind of needs, if that makes sense. So yeah, I picked up this Tangle Teaser brush. This is going to go in somebody's stocking. Tangle Teasers are so much better for your hair. Brush them, it doesn't rip it out, doesn't break it. And yeah, and it's also a really pretty pink colour. This is perfect for anyone, like any age. You can stick this in a little girl's stocking, you can stick it in your older sister's stocking, you can stick it in your great nan's stocking, anyone's. And they would find a use for this. Tangle teaser. What else do I got in here? Is this like kind of what's the word? 
not tradition what am i trying to say there's this speculation going around at christmas time that people don't enjoy getting socks but i just absolutely love getting socks how could you not enjoy getting socks anyway i picked up two pairs of socks these just got little dogs on them because who doesn't love new socks and who doesn't love dogs let's be real so these are going to go in stockings again everyone loves getting new socks as much as they don't like to admit it, everybody loves to get a new pair of socks at Christmas. So I picked these up from Forever 21, they're £1.50 each. Cute. I also in Tiger I picked up this little like dish, like a little glass painted dish. I feel like for the like the nans and the great nans and whoever, they can stick this in the kitchen and put stuff on there, they can put it in their bedroom on their dressing table, just put little bits and pieces on there and I just thought it was really cute. And again, this is going to go in someone's stocking. I'm not going to say who. But yeah, I love this. I feel like it's hand painted. This is from Tiger. I'm sure this was only a couple of pounds as well. But for the kitchen side, for your Nan's dressing table, put like their jewellery on there. They can put, say, tea bags on there if they're making tea in the kitchen. Just so many different things you can use these for. Yeah, very handy, very practical, but also very pretty. So another present idea is just vouchers. So I've got two here. So we've got one for Boo Avenue and then one for Pandora. Vouchers are just like an easy present to give. You know that they're gonna love them. They can pick something for themselves without just giving them money. So I feel like there's a bit more thought behind giving someone a voucher rather than just handing them over 20 pound. So got a couple of vouchers here. Oh, another pair of socks that I forgot to mention. So I picked these cornflake socks up. Picked these up in Primark. I saw them, I just had to get them. They look like they're in a cornflake actual cereal box. I just had to get these. <laughs> these are, I'm sure they're two pound 50. And you get cornflake socks in there, but I just, I had to okay I just had to so this is another easy one but just some of that somebody's favorite sweets and chocolates always it goes down a treat <laughs> literally <laughs> somebody's favorite sweets or chocolate they'll be buzzing about that in their stocking so we've got these the person watching already knows these are for them because we get them every year but yeah sweets and chocolate always a yes from everyone right so I've just got a few like stocking bits and pieces in this bag that I'm just gonna quickly run through so these are stocking ideas for anyone that's struggling with stockings. A fluffy pen. Again, I got this from Tiger. Fluffy rainbow pen. Love this. It's a biro. And you're just going to be the coolest kid in school if you turn up with this. This is from Tiger as well. I swear, Tiger has literally got the best. I've never been in there before. But me and Oak went in there and we were literally blown away by all the stuff that was in there. Here we have a little IQ puzzle. I don't know what it is or what you're supposed to do with it, but that's for the person to work out. So you've got little like games, not games, but like, what are they called? Just stuff to test your brain. So I saw these and just thought they were great. So this is a little man <laughs> and he grows grass out of his head. <laughs> Pretty much, and that's it. That's all it, that's all it is. But stockings aren't for useful things. Unless it's like body spray, shower gel, that kind of stuff. Stockings are for just crap that no one needs. But everyone needs at the same time. So this is a little grass growing man. I'm sure he just water his head. Yeah, he water his head. And the grass grows out of his hair. Not so long ago, I went to Primark and picked up these two little eyeshadow palettes. I'm just gonna open one of them. But these were on sale from four pound down to one pound. So I picked up two just to stick in stockings again. And they actually have really pretty colors in here. So you've got oranges, you've got brown, you've got golds. So you've got two mattes and two shimmers. What more could you need in an eyeshadow palette? For a pound as well. So I picked up two of those. Bargain. Primark is always a bargain when it comes to makeup products. Primark's always a bargain, full star. Primark have so many good stocking fillers in there as well. So that is definitely a place to go if you're looking for stuff to put into stocking. Guess who this is for? I wonder who. He already knows that he's got this, but this is for Oak. It's just like a travel mug, but this is for when he stays at my house because I always drink tea out of these cups and he doesn't have one. So I've got his own one for when he stays here. It's just grey. It's got a little bit of pink on there, but it's fine. Got an O on it, so it's for oak. Grey lid. This is from B&M. This was only £3, so it's personalised. Means a little bit more than just having a plain cup. And yeah, lovely. I also know I'm going to be using this as well as oak. Sorry, oak. And then just a pack of air fresheners again from B&M to stick in someone's stocking. So for someone that's got a car, you've got six air fresheners in here for £1.50. They're like flamingos and florally designs. 
six for one pound fifty. Can't really go wrong. Simple but like an essential that everybody needs. So yeah, one pound fifty. Perfect for a stocking again. Right guys, that is the end of this video. I hope you did enjoy my first Christmas video of 2019. Hope it did give you some inspiration into what you can get from where and all the price budgets. Everything I got here was really cheap, so love that for me. So if you did enjoy this video, don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. Subscribe down below for more from me. And other than that, I'll see you in my next video.